Ready, go! Forward, back, yep. Quick save. What's up guys, so it's uh, Monday, and like I said yesterday, uh, we have a full week of training right now. Armando got invited to a combine, and um, there's a few coaches that we are interested in speaking to. So as a goalkeeper coach for me, when I have somebody who has a, uh, a you know a big event or like a big game on the weekend, what I like to do and what I was you know trained to do was um, at the beginning of the week we want to get in a lot of not fitness but a lot of shots you know get them to see a lot of shots get their reaction time uh, right get them into a lot of game situations <clears throat> some crossing a lot of finishing we're gonna go to the field right now I have a few um, drills that are just kind of addressing certain things that I, I we Armando and I have both seen with his footwork so we're gonna try and tidy that stuff up so so you know mentally he feels sharp but one of our buddies Eddie who's gonna come to the field with us and he's gonna be um, taking some shots as well he's a lefty so he's gonna give us a different type of angle um, on different shots I'm a righty so we're gonna try and mix all that stuff in so I want to make sure on Monday and Wednesday that Armando gets you know as, as fatigued as possible just so we can you know get him into uh, game shape and um, get him into you know the feeling of, of, of playing in competitive games again and so around Friday time Thursday Friday we're gonna taper off a little bit we're gonna let him kind of rest up recover um, take ice baths whatever he needs to do get himself mentally sharp Sharp. And then on Friday, we're gonna do a lot of crossing, and I'm gonna and a lot of crossing, uh, short crosses, a lot of distribution with the hands, the feet, a lot of the stuff that you'll see in the game. Some shot stopping, but at that point, uh, I'm gonna just take off a little bit more because I don't want him to be too fatigued, and I don't want him to uh, be too tired. I want him to be fresh. So, um, yeah, well, uh, just follow us. This is uh, Life of a Goalkeeper, vlog number two, starting right now.
guy, huh? How good is this guy? The monitor is great, comes off on one foot, lands on two. As he comes across, he's a little too far from his near post, which leaves it very open. And also, he's in a shoulder width position, which is great, but as the shot comes, you can see right there that his legs open up into a wide stance, and that makes it very difficult to take a power step to dive. On this next play right here, as Mondo gets over and gets set for this shot, instead of setting, he jumps into the air as the ball is being struck. So he's stuck in the air now, and by the time the ball gets shot and he realizes it's going to go low, he's stuck in the air and can't get back to the ground. guys so we are at the field right now we just finished up our uh, Monday session um, the first few drills went as planned everything was good uh, but as we stepped into like the, the bigger goal um, it wasn't as smooth as we would have liked but that's good though I think you know for for Mondo on a Monday where he has a few more days to recover watch film and kind of understand the mistakes he was making or how he was setting and if anything if it was like a psychological thing if he was just overthinking it and um, which is good that's exactly what we want to do with you guys and with, with the goalkeepers if you have a big game on the weekend you kind of want to put yourself in really uncomfortable situations um, just to kind of see how you react and uh, unfortunately you know our buddy Eddie today put some nice shots in and, and you know put some uh, um, good shots on frame 
but uh, we really focus a lot on the crossing. We that's good. That's the good we're going to take from the session. We want to put them in situations where it isn't as natural, so that as they come to the weekend, they're prepared for just about anything. Uh, what they're good at, especially what they're not good at, and I think we did that today. So that's it for the Monday session. We will be back on Wednesday and doing a similar type of session like this, still hitting the ground pretty hard because we'll have two or three days to rest and recover. And um, that's it for today. So we'll see you guys on Wednesday, okay? Peace.